De La Wright, my envies. Welcome. The sister to the owner of Ife is said to have expressed her dissatisfaction over the way Olori Naomi treated her and that she does not understand why Naomi is so unforgiving and why Naomi cannot trust her anymore. That um, they said something very, very serious happened when uh, she uh, went to Akure, you know, accompanied by Dr. Elizabeth to go and pick Oni of Ife's uh, meal. You know that Oni of Ife was asked to stop eating meals, except um, meals that are made by Olori Naomi and that's the reason why Olori Naomi who is supposed to be in Lekki at the time where school is in section for Tadenikawo had to come to um, 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 Akure so she can be preparing meals for the Oni of Ife but of course you do know that um, Akure to um, the palace of the Oni of Ife is um, quite a distance not that much but of course uh, that drive is not something a woman will be doing every time okay even if you're going with a driver and all of that it's, it's, it's risky okay Okay. And so, as we're hearing, uh, they said that this day it was Dr. Elizabeth. Um, Dr. Elizabeth's trip was not over. You know, he, she was still doing whatever she was doing in uh, Switzerland, but she had to come back because um, Kabiasi wanted her to be the one to be picking the mails and bringing back to the palace of the owner of Ife. As we are hearing, you know, as it is rumored, they said that um, when Dr. Elizabeth got to Akure to go and pick Oni's meal, that... Um, uh, uh, only sister, one of the sisters had gone with aha, aha. and upon you know um, um, uh, entering the gate and entering into the major uh, building, Nami was coming from upstairs and Tadenika was following Nami from behind and so Tadenika was now you know like a child same visitors at home the child now decided to you know um, um, pass the mother I was running towards the visitors Nami held the boy and kept behind her back and you, you know, she went to gang. And the aunt was saying, What is this? What is the meaning of this? Why are you holding my son from greeting me? What is this? What is it? What is it with you, Naomi? How come it, it does seem as if you're very unforgiving? For everything that happened before, you can let it go. You up until now we have begged and we have begged and we have begged. And what is it? And the man the woman felt really, really bad. He said Nami was just there. Nami did not say a word to her. You know something about Queen Naomi? Nami is um a woman of very few words, except she feels that it's very important for her to bed it out. She um, probably wanted to stay inside like she would not say anything. So she greeted. She never explained why she helped Kadenikawo behind. But it's important for people to understand that Naomi is somebody who has got a lot of dis got discernment. Uh, she knows exactly what she's doing and the choices she makes at every given time. You know, when I talk like this, more people come, most people come to me and they say, and uh, do you think Nami is perfect? No, I'm not saying she is perfect, but from what we have heard time and time again from a lot of people, this one is really a good woman. If you want to know a good woman, you, you start by knowing them by the content of their character. One of the very, the most, um, the weakest part of women is our tongue, the way we talk, our alterances, when we talk to people without respect, when we talk, when we are not expected to talk, when our mouth is always open, not bringing any value and all of that. That also is something that makes you know the kind of person you are dealing with. Okay, so going back to what this is all about, as we are hearing allegedly, mm -hmm, it says she held the child behind and the aunt was very, very upset about that and she did not hide it. She expressed her anger so much that it was Dr. Elizabeth I was coming her down that it's not like that. They should know that um, Naomi is somebody who is very reserved and all that. They said they know Naomi very well that Naomi did that for a reason. But, you know, they said after they've carried the food the entire time in the car, she was very upset that she even started crying. And so they said when she came down, she started crying to the brother, telling the brother the experience with Naomi and how Naomi has not forgiven them, how Naomi sees them as enemies and that was why Naomi did that. But for me I want to think that Naomi is just being a mother being very protective of her son Naomi is somebody, like, I, I have said this time and time again, Naomi is just a young mother and that's her only son she's just being protective. I don't think that is something that anybody wants to take personal, especially for you who is a woman who also has like um, your own um, children. So welcome back to my channel, it's De La I might bring you fresh and spicy just from the sauce is still on the royals. How are you guys doing? I appreciate you. I love you. I thank you, Asheo. I do well, my people. Thank you so much. Thank you for being here for me. Thank you for always returning back to my channel. Thank you for the loyalty. I appreciate each and every one of you so much. Okay. Mm -hmm. 
If you're here and you're yet to subscribe, kindly go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And do not forget to turn on the notification bell and do not forget to give this video a thumbs up. Dale right, my Dale right, my Dale right, my simple people. Dale right, my Dale right, my Dale right, my simple people. Okay, thank you, people. And so, um, now, you do know that, you know, when Naomi was in the palace, there was this talk about the sisters being part of the reason why Naomi left. They were questioning things like that. It was a whole lot that there was so much connivance. Even though the older sister had come so many times to debunk that information that is um, bloggers who are just making it and up that it is not true, okay? And this is the reason why... I say to Dela Wright, because of the respect that I have for each and every one of you, I let you know that, you know, because you, I am not in the palace with these people, you can never really ascertain which one is true and which one is not true. And it's important for you to understand this and so that you know how to bear all of this information that comes, okay? And so the sister had come to debunk that um, this day. Okay, maybe, perhaps Nami is operating with them based on her experiences. Sometimes it's very difficult to go to set experiences and just want to put it behind your back as if it never happened sometimes it's absolutely difficult to do that so if she's had a bad experience with these people and um, perhaps they did um stuff that is so reprehensible in her mind and um she had expected much from them or um, more so um, respected them so much, it will be difficult for her to just be totally trusting like that, especially as it has to do with her kids. Sometimes for parents, like mothers, you, you can do anything to them, but don't go close to their children. If you go close to, their, to a woman's child, <laughs> then you will know that that woman is powerful. The woman might be as weak as anything, but the moment you go close to her child, you see the strength in the woman. So every woman is like that. So they said she cried so much, but Nami did not do anything or say anything. But when she got to the palace, she um, uh, spoke to her brother about the way she was treated by Olori Nami, that she is not happy about the way Nami treated her. Nami um, held her nephew from coming close to her to greet her and they said the entire time until the woman sat down they brought the meals and the woman left nami was just holding tadenikawo nami did not allow tadenikawo go to touch that woman or to greet the woman or anything that nami did not allow and up until now she has not explained why she did that maybe she's got the discernment or maybe just maybe so a lot of us when we talk we tend to think that she's letting her guards down you know this event has come to show that she's not letting her guard down at all yes yeah, so that she is not letting her guard won't be down, okay? She's not trusting because they dealt with that woman so much. So I don't know how if how is she going to even, you know, um, deal with things in the palace? How? 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 Well, it's um, a gist that I'm going to bring up as an update to you. I appreciate you guys so much. Thank you.